while testing cosmetics on animals here in California is already illegal, companies can still sell products here that were tested on animals somewhere else. And the folks behind the California Cruelty-Free Cosmetics Act want to change that. China currently requires animal testing uh, to sell the products in their country. However, if you have your manufacturing plant in China, they don't require it. So it's a way to get Americans to move over to China. Judy Mancuso explains the bill goes beyond current law, which outlaws animal testing here, and makes it illegal for a company to knowingly import or sell cosmetics that were tested on animals anywhere after the year 2020. Now, organizations like PETA and Cruelty Free International offer certifications and search tools to help consumers see which companies already pass their cruelty free test. So I went through my own makeup to find out if mine was tested on animals. Now, most of my makeup is Jane Iredell, which is recognized as cruelty free by both Cruelty International's Leaping Bunny certification and PETA. That means they don't test on animals, use ingredients tested on animals, or sell makeup in places like China that require animal testing. But most of my drugstore makeup didn't pass the test. From my Maybelline and L'Oreal mascaras to my Rimmel London eyeliner and Kim Kardashian West contour kit, every brand had a similar disclaimer. They don't test or no longer test on animals themselves, but they do sell in markets like China where the government requires it. And we don't want China's policies uh, and their ethics influencing California and the United States. The folks behind the bill hope it will encourage China to change its animal testing requirements, ultimately forcing U.S. companies to choose between selling in China or California. Now, the bill includes an exemption for products sold in China until 2023, giving the Chinese government time to revise its animal testing regulations. Current products already on the market are also exempted from this bill. In San Francisco, I'm Julie Watts.